Hey, y'all, check this out. Quick market update going over the charts here, looking at Bitcoin. Bitcoin respecting this counter trend line, heading up towards 23,000, maybe. Or are we going to break this counter trend line and make a new low? So that's the big question here. A lot of people think the bottom is in and that's it. But typically, in order to confirm a bottom, we need to see a double bottom. That'll kind of confirm support. So at least get close to it that's what i would like to see if this was actually the bottom we would be ranging and we would see something something like this we would kind of be in this range it'll kind of keep retesting that same level if that was in fact the bottom but right now i don't see that a lot of people are excited you know there's a ton of green in the market but definitely be mindful of what's going on pay attention to the technicals pay attention to the charts because nothing has been confirmed yet no bottom has been confirmed yet, at least on our technical analysis here at Clockwise Crypto. And, you know, you guys can comment your thoughts, con comment your opinions. We've been uh, just transparent about telling you what we see and how we see it. And we'll kind of go through with that. So looking at this chart, looking at Ethereum, Ethereum, uh, you know, adjusting this trend line here uh, from what we had from Tuesday. Uh, no new low was made. The trend line wasn't a uh, really broken uh, but looking here on the four hour time frame and even going to the daily uh, if we want to get really close to it uh, the four hours kind of keeping it pretty tight for us on how we like it and they're pretty much seeing the same thing resistance level sitting at about 1400 uh, but there's also another resistance level here uh, that we could pay attention to and I think that's about 1300 even uh, we want to you know a psychological level here uh, but also just being paying attention to the zone uh, we try not to say exact price points which is why before the drop to 17,000 our range was 17,000 to 20,000 right so I would say the same range here anywhere from 12 from 1250 to 1300 would be our range for ethereum and that's what we will look at here are we gonna break above uh, something just an idea are we gonna break above retest and continue upwards or are we going to respect this level continue down and continue to make new lows so that's something to pay attention to our target for ethereum was 800 dollars. so we did we got close uh we got close to 881 we got close it was off by 80 dollars, but you know our our pullback target was 800 dollars even uh, that didn't necessarily happen yet uh we'll see what happens like i said even even looking at the Ethereum chart, no bottom has been confirmed. This is just a pullback, a healthy pullback, as we've seen before. Uh, price drops, uh, it does rally back, and you know it's it's healthy. It's a healthy moving market. If anything just went back up with no pullback, that would that wouldn't be a healthy market. So pay attention to that, and that's something that we're looking at too. Um, what's going to happen in this market in this retracement so uh as we look at that we will continue to keep you updated but as of right now nothing has been confirmed yet and i just wanted to make this video to really just give you our outlook of what's going on we're getting a lot of messages saying oh what's going on with with uh with bitcoin what's going on with ethereum is the bottom in we don't see the bottom in yet so that's just our analysis right now looking at cardano cardano uh had a potential to have huge news with Charles Hoskins, CEO, having that interview with Congress, but really not much price action because of that, really because it wasn't about Cardano. It was about really the cryptocurrency industry as a whole. Uh, but what we're seeing here is pretty much the same story. Uh, and that's good to see when you're talking about quality projects, are they moving with the, with the market as a whole? Uh, I would, you know, we're always uh, aware and and cautious of projects that are taking significant pumps while everything else is is, is stagnant or going going negative oh it's just because the project's so good uh not really but uh we'll see we got a major level of resistance here with cardano at 50 cents um our range for that is is, is anywhere from anywhere from i would say 50 49 to 50 cents um but we're actually pretty much there we're at 50 cents almost exactly right now um that range would be anywhere from 48 to 50 we'll see if we break above or we respect this range for cardano like i said our idea based off of everything we see based off of the fundamentals of what we see in the markets is prices coming up resistance could break down we got it really if this is the low if that was the low that we experienced last week we expect a retest 
So we can confirm a double bottom in that range. So either way, we see it coming back. So you guys definitely may have some good buying opportunities there. That's really what we see in the marketplace today. Just wanted to give you a quick market update of our technical analysis here on Friday. Hope you got some value out of this video. Like, comment, subscribe, but also comment your thoughts. What do you think is gonna happen in the market? What is your idea based off of the, your technical analysis? And keep moving forward in everything that you do, and we'll see you soon.